Hey, what's going on everybody? Gonna do a quick little video on Jaron Hall, not to take up anybody's time. Uh, I just wanna shoot my uh, shot on what I think is gonna happen with Jaron Hall as a Minnesota Viking. I think that in the grand scheme of things, I don't see him being a full-time starter. I see him more as a secure quarterback that can be there long-term. Um, and we got him for four years which his contract would be even cheaper than what Nick Mullins would be. So I think Nick Mullins only got signed to a one-year extension. Um, so instead of paying Nick Mullins on all these one-year contracts, I think after this season, Nick Mullins is going to be gone. And, uh, and Jaron Hawes is going to be there absorbing everything like a sponge. He's just going to be in the shadows of Kirk Cousins and Nick Mullins. And you never know, he could turn out to be a really, a really good quarterback. And he could be just one of those uh, clipboard holders and then turn out to be a uh, uh, eventual Kevin O'Connell, an assistant uh, coach, assistant head coach um, for the Minnesota Vikings or for any team out there. Um, I honestly don't see that guy being like long-term solution. I think that with him being a Minnesota Viking, I think that uh, he's just going to be the third string. He's going to be the third stringer. Uh, then I, we're not. We shouldn't expect too much out of Jaron Hall. You could honestly look up anybody's highlights, and on YouTube, they're gonna look fantastic. They're gonna be, ah, did you see that throw? But then they won't post the, the low lights up. You know, you gotta look up the low lights before you look at the highlights. I looked up his low lights on it right here on YouTube, and he made some terrible, terrible interception. Like these were some god awful throws. So don't expect this guy to be like in competition against Kirk Cousins, Nick Mullins, straight back up. I think Nick Mullins is going to be with us uh, for this upcoming season, and then he's going to hit the road. And uh, Minnesota is going to draft the quarterback next year. They're going to draft the quarterback next year. Um, and uh, Jaron Hall, he'll be he'll be he might be the day one starter uh, because next year I can't see them wanting to extend Kirk Cousins. And uh, Jaron Hall, he'll be probably the day one starter unless we can get like somehow get the the, the top notch. Uh, the, cream of the crop quarterback next year in the NFL draft um, and yeah I just don't see that Jaron Hall is going to be long-term solution he'll be in the he'll be in the quarterback room clipboard holder and all that but I don't see too much success out of him um, and yeah that's what I honestly think is going to happen with uh, with Jaron Hall Jaron Hall seems like a bright kid and all that but let's be honest he gives he, he gives me straight Kellen Mond 2.0 vibes bro he gives me Kellen Mond 2.0 I think at best at best I can see you know what? I can't even see him as a starter, man. I'm tired of getting my hopes up. You know, he's going to have to prove it to me. He's, he's got to go in there and actually do really good for a full season. He's got to actually show me that he can play in the NFL before I'm going to sit here and, you know, get my rocks off. Because I did the same mistake with uh, Kellen Mond. Kellen Mond, I was like, oh, my God, look at his highlights on YouTube. YouTube, this, YouTube. Yeah, yeah, now look where he's at. Is he even on the, on the, on the quarterback depth chart over there in Cleveland? Like, come on, man. You gotta, people gotta stop buying into the into the YouTube highlights, into the highlight reels, because it's so easy, easy to make somebody look really, really good, especially on a three or four, three to five minute uh, video, anywhere you look him up. So yeah, I think that Jaron Hall is gonna be a, a solidified backup for the Minnesota Vikings. I think um, Kirk Cousins is gonna be the starter, and then we're gonna let, like I said, Nick Mullins go, and uh, yeah, we're gonna draft our quarterback next year in the draft. So that's all I got for you guys uh, today. Um, yeah, let me know if you guys uh, think differently. Maybe you guys can change my mind. And if not, just keep things moving and uh, we'll move on to the next video. But until then, I'm out. Skull Vikings.